Greetings. Welcome to podcast three, which will deal with uh, modules, modules three and four, the birth of modernity, science, democracy, and capitalism. My podcast will be organized uh, in three parts, uh, generally. So the first part will be an overview of the module discourse, this idea of the birth of modernities. The second part will uh, give an overview of the text, uh, specifically the first two texts that we'll look at. Uh, and then the third part will be an annotated reading or riff uh, on the two texts that we are looking at. Okay, part one. Uh, so we, what is this module about? What is this discourse about? So the birth of modernity, science, democracy and capitalism, where we have four texts that we're going to look at in excerpted form. This, these texts include uh, Galileo Sidereus Nuncius from 1610, John Locke's Second Treatise of Government from 1689, Adam Smith's Wealth of Nations from 1776, and Charles Darwin's On the Origin of Species from 1859. And so what we are looking at here are the birth or births of these modernities. And birth uh, should be understood, or births should be understood in scare quotes, okay? So we're problematizing that idea of birth. So we could talk about, we could say that there are really two birth moments that we're looking at. One is the birth moment, uh, the traditional sort of foundational uh, view of how these modernities arose, how they historically progressed. And the second birth moment is uh, what was excluded from these birth moments, or more, maybe more specifically, who was excluded and how they were excluded from this birth moment. Okay, so the first thing to look at, right, is uh, let me just play around with the, you know, the dates, first of all. So we're, uh, so we're looking at the 17th century, at least that's where we're starting with, with Galileo and Locke. So we're starting in the 17th century here, which is this, uh, this moment when, um, you know, uh, science, there's uh, the scientific revolution going on, there are democratic revolutions going on, and ultimately there are capitalistic revolutions going on. 